Rebecca Andrews of the Burke Museum of Natural History and Culture, and I've been invited by the Arts Council of Mongolia to go to Mongolia and teach museum professionals how to use archival materials. The materials have already arrived in Mongolia, and there are five different materials. This is Davy Bookboard. This is Plank Ethophone. This is Silver Cloth. Twill Tape and acid-free tissue paper. And we're going to go through some sessions of showing the staff how to use these materials when they work with the relics and precious objects that they're um, taking care of in their museum collections. We've you end up with scraps of ethophone, so this is a way to make the ethophone go farther. If you, This is a tippy bowl, so if you wanted to make a mount where you could pick it up. So what we're going to do is, is end up with four chunks um, in each corner. And you need to start then shaping them so that the chunk of foam is the contour of the bowl. That's a little bit harder, and it takes some practice. That's why we work with um, scraps. And, and basically, I'm going to kind of cut triangular. So you can see I've gotten closer. And we'll cut some of that one. So then, um, and, and you can actually shape these a little bit more. And then we can um, glue these in place with the, using the glue again. You can trace around here that you want the. Glue does take longer than other glues to dry, so we'll just put these pieces on here. And when we're done, we would cut tissue or cut the, ethoph the thin ethophone again to line this. So we'll cut a piece of tissue. write the catalog number right here on the Davy board. So. And how would you then carry it, Becky, or would you, you would just with your hands like that? Yeah. And the bowl is going to be held in place there. And would you ever...